The blast, as we mentioned, happening today at the site of LEAP Incorporated. LEAP, which stands for Life Enrichment Advancing People, has been advocating for adults living with cognitive, intellectual, and developmental disabilities since 1980. Yeah, it's an organization that provides the support these folks need to live independently. Lindsay is here now with much more on what happens there. Lindsay. Lee and Cindy, we first got a look inside one of the group homes for Elite back in 2014. And that's where and when we learned that the organization truly means a lot to the community. Caitlin Turner takes her role volunteering at a local hospital very seriously. <sighs> She's dedicated to her duties and to her community. She's one of many who are building relationships, finding purpose, and working towards living independently through Leap Incorporated. And off we go. Kristen Grandin works at Franklin Memorial Hospital. She always looks forward to seeing Caitlin. Our volunteers here do a lot of work for us, and they're extremely helpful, and we appreciate what they do. And especially little Caitlin, she's great. I'll see you next week. When we first met Caitlin in 2014, she was a resident of one of Leap's group homes. What you making today, Mike? Where she and others learn everything about everyday skills and making important life decisions on their own. Caitlin is one of the more than 75 people Leap serves with nearly 200 employees, providing services to encourage acceptance and boost empowerment. You go right straight down towards this way. And we did receive a statement earlier today from Leap Incorporated saying, quote, our hearts go out to anyone injured or impacted today. There were many heroes whose actions saved additional lives. Those heroes included first responders, Leap staff, and neighbors, Cindy and Lee. Mm, such a tough day for them. Lindsay, thank you very much.